One of the most famous <laughs> high school basketball players was just arrested for assault with a deadly weapon. Man, this, this is Mikey bad. Williams. He is very good at basketball and has been for such a long time and has gotten so famous on social media that Puma gave him a sneaker deal at the age of 17. Now, as a basketball recruit, Mikey missed the McDonald's All-American game. He's now down to a four-star. He's currently committed to go to Memphis. But yesterday, he was arrested for five charges of assault with a deadly weapon. Bro, what? What was one? Let me see. Can I go back real quick? Five stars. Oh, uh, they don't. Yo, this, this hurt my heart, bro. Yesterday, he was arrested for five charges of assault with a deadly weapon. Now, according to this report from the San Diego County Sheriff's Department, this is allegedly what happened. There was an argument in the house. A group of about five guests was asked to leave. They got into a car as the car was driving away. Shots were fired and the car was hit, but no one was hurt. Mikey Williams is alleged to be the one who shot at the car. He's out on bail, but each one of those counts has a minimum of six months. God, that's two and a half years, man. I don't, I mean, I, I don't even think that there's going to be anyone who was even interested in the idea of even, you know, having them on the team. Like, shooting a deadly weapon is, like, crazy. Like, no, but it's all alleged. I, alleged, yeah. Alleged. Yeah, yeah, I'm about to giving say, me yeah. Iris vibes. I mean, fair, I mean, it could, fair. Fair. Yeah, I mean, so, very, very much so fair, but yo, to I even be fair. around that type of environment His activity. Is even crazy. even if he was uh, around the environment, fuck the environment. To act, participate in that activity of shooting at a car that's fleeing. Nigga, you're nuts. It didn't cause you any harm, nigga. You go come on, bro. It's alleged though. I'm I'm I'm, I'm gonna give my brother that brother the benefit of the doubt, man. I don't know the circumstance, I don't know the situation, it's alleged. You feel me? I, you can some one of y'all watching this video could go do something. And I could be like, or, or, or one of y'all watching the video, I could just be like, yeah, they did this. So it's alleged, but we don't know. I hope. That activity, I hope it's I very... just refuse to believe the people around him will allow him to be the one to shoot it. Something was probably shot. It's all alleged, but him to be yeah, the one to, to say, shoot it is. And then the other thing is, when you're a person like that and you got a name for yourself and stuff like that, bro. Um. It's easy to be the target of a situation like that because you're around it. So your name is going to be the first name like plastered there. Like, oh, Mike, Mikey was there? Yeah, he, yeah, it was, you know what I'm saying? Like, versus these guys, not saying like that, that they're unknown, but they're not as, like, okay, for example, his name will, will, will be, as far as like the prosecutor and all that, like in the media and all that, it will be a big case. And when you got those big cases, like people like, prosecutors and the cops and all that they want to be attached to that because it's like clout it it, it 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 gives them a name as well so imagine them it's, it sounds crazy but it's true like imagine them catching this 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 soon-to-be superstar caught up in this nonsense and then they that that's that that could set the tone they could they could get a name off this case you know what i'm saying so that's why you got to be very careful man like if he even if he's even around this kind of activity, man, I feel as though it's it's not a good look, man. Because unfortunately, even if you didn't do something, you're dragged into it now. Like it becomes Mikey's friends shot at. You know what I'm saying? Like it's not even them. Their name plastic. Like like shit, shit like that. You got to be very careful. And I get it. He's young and stuff, but once you get like in this kind of industry or like basketball and you're in the media, you got to be very careful, bro. Insane because if you're he's in a, a kid, though, so he's gonna make you mistakes, know but this, this is, is that cool. guy, bro. Everybody's seen Mikey play if not on TikTok, on IG, or on YouTube. His hoop mixtapes have millions the people of... around him. They yes, know who he is. bro, you cannot let him take the fall for that or do something Yo, that's that's a... stupid. It's Another just... thing, real quick, off topic. I know I'm chatting right now. Another thing, real quick, what they did to Michael Vick was crazy. His friends, his family, whoever was in the crib when they was fighting them dogs, he wasn't there. They had picked him up somewhere else. One of them should have took that point blank, period. Point blank, period. Even though it was at his house, I get it. One of them should have stood up and took that one. Like that, like that, that, that ruined his career, bro. And you, sh and, and y'all know he's the breadwinner. He's the, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, he's probably, Michael Vick is probably a stand up guy, same like Mikey. So even if, if nobody else says nothing and owns up to it, of course, and it's like, and if Cindy, they're there, they're, they're probably going to take it because they feel as though they're obligated as well. You know what I'm saying? So it's kind of like, bro, you got to. You gotta separate after this. Hopefully he gets away he gets away from the situation scot free or whatever. I ain't gonna say scot free, but like no jail time and no charges. And this is just a, a real good lesson to him to realize like yo, what I got going on is more important than nonsense. I hope so, bro.
Is they gonna try to make an example out of him? Take the charge for? I think it's so yes. egregiously dumb. I would be genuinely perplexed if he was the one who did it. Mike, I would be Mike very Vick? surprised. Unfortunately, John couldn't state. do it because he's on video. That's your bad decision. Let's say he did do it. You think somebody? Hundred percent. One million percent. One nigga has to go for that. It's two and a half years. If he takes it, that's a minimum. That if yeah, oh, <laughs> bro, if he takes it, his his career is like. It's no, done. no, I get that. It's done. You remember when Iverson got sent, sentenced to fifteen years? No, for sure. He got pardoned. Yes. And Georgetown gave him a, a lucky break. Yes. The, those are very uncommon scenarios. I, I know because it's very uncommon. Mike very Vick. uncommon <laughs> scenarios. And in that case, it sure did look like the the evidence was pointing to Iverson was being framed. Yes. In this instance, we don't know all the details. The reports, what it looks like from what we've seen so far, some shots were fired at a vehicle that was driving away. So you can't argue self-defense if the vehicle is driving exactly. away and they're saying he's the one who shot it. That's an S-tier bad decision. No, it is. It's so bad of a decision, I refuse to believe he's he dumb was enough dumb to enough do that. To do I it, genuinely, yeah. genuinely. But let's say he did it. it. Someone has to take the fall. Somebody has to take the fall. That's 100%. Would you take the fall? If my friend was like five stars. Yeah, with real friends? 100%. Yeah. Because you got to think. You would take the charge. Yeah, because they're in an environment. First of all, it's in California and they have a gun. You're already done. So you're already committing. You're you're in a zone at that point. If yeah. you're in, if they already have made bad decisions leading up to that yes. moment. Yes. Feel me? For having a gun in California yes. and firing it thinking that you would be able to argue self defense. You're not, that's not, it's not in Florida. Cars right? fleeting, you're not yeah, Florida, yeah. That's the I didn't know where they were. Even over. anywhere where somebody's driving away and that's it's what you're doing is going to be kind of tough for you, my boy. Uh, he was released on a $50,000 bond. Which is also kind of interesting, but no, because he already had um a deal with Puma and he's, stuff like that. And he's seventeen, bro. At the end of the day, what people don't even realize too, with these bonds, bro, you can put up your house. You don't necessarily have to put all like or, you know what I'm saying. Like you don't have to put, you don't have to give them fifty thousand dollars. He's, he's seventeen, 17 right? right? Yeah. You can put your house. Look, up. man, I, I don't know. A part of me feels like I will. A, I value my life enough to not be around that type of environment. So that's a. B. I don't know if I would take the charge for somebody. I'm, be, I'm just keeping. I'm just keeping a thousand. I don't think I would take the charge, bro. If you were a five star NFL recruit, you're yeah. gonna be the O lineman, number five overall draft pick. You taking the charge? And I and I know we're carrying illegal weapons on us, yes. knowing it could compromise everything you've worked your life for. Yes. One of the niggas in the group. That's, that's, your, one inter, that's your real friend. Yeah, they have to take it. 100%. No, 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 no. They don't even say that they're going to take it this crazy. But you in the group, though. Yes. If, and if, one day I wilded out. I was like, yeah, 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 yeah. you taking the charge? It depends how dumb you were being. <laughs> oh, see? Now, no, no, see, hold on, hold on. See. No, 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 If, 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 if he was hit, the if, confrontation if, and guns had to fly yeah then, yes gonna, but if you went out your way to shoot to do somebody, some super, yeah shoot somebody kill somebody by accident i'm not taking it. I, I agree i agree i agree with what uh agent saying that's that's a fact you could be only i'm not gonna say dumb for your friends you could have almost loyalty i can't really say that because then the conversation that becomes what is true loyalty some people will say loyalty is, is just loyalty like there's no if ands or buts about it there's no like a visible wall or a line to be crossed. Like, loyalty is loyalty all across. But I say, I agree, in lo agree with loyalty, but at the same time, being blindly leaded to do some stupid shit, it's not loyal. It's just stupid. I was bugging that day. Okay, then I'm not gonna... I think, I think, um, um, my mans from Dipset said it the best, man. Jo Joel's, yo, it's a quote. I hope I... If y'all yeah, know the quote, Find a video, clip it, or whatever, and tell me what it was. Joel said it, bro. It's some, it was something about loyalty. <laughs> exactly. We would have to have a conversation, bro. Exactly. We have to have a fact. I need to know the full details before I throw my life away. From but if he did, you should know. Did, boy. I, just need, I just need to know. Um, he was, people say he was better than me at my age. I was considered top two player in the state of California. He had offers from USC and Arizona and all that stuff. Everybody in the country recruited me. But the influences around him is what stopped him from proceeding to the next level. And then, I got into the whole gang aspect and uh, I ended up getting locked up and uh, did 10 months. You know, made some mistakes in my life, you know what I mean? I've been through some uh, some tough things, but you know, we all live, we live and we learn. So just Man. just, just throw, that, throw that in, Caleb. So Damn, bro. Damn, I ain't gonna lie, that sound, that, that's crazy. Your dad went through the same exact, allegedly. Went through something that you're suddenly going through, and damn, bro, sins of the father. For those who don't know, that was um, that's his father. It just so happens that the cycle is now repeating itself. Allegedly, brother, come on, let's stay positive. Let's, let's keep this young brother out of jail. Let's, 
hopefully this this, this story just is false. Right. That clip was from uh, a few years ago. And, and remember from the podcast, Davo had told us a story about how he was one of the top ranked running backs in yeah. all of South Carolina. And then all it took was one text in a group chat where he made a threat to a rival team and all his offers from all the top schools got pulled. <laughs> got pulled we yeah. see this so often. In this case, familial, like his father, like how many examples of somebody fumbling a very important <clears throat> bag? That's like an even mis- like, And it depends, right? There's some environments like DeMar DeRozan when he grew up in Compton. You can't even avoid it. So in that case, mm-hmm. there's going to be some level of gang activity or affiliation and that's just the reality of the yeah. community. That- Point blank period, bro. If you're from, if you from the bricks, from the trenches, you from the PJs, you f- you from wherever. That's 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 an urban community. That's a little that's rough. Point blank period. There's gonna always be something going on. There's always gonna be some kind of insinuation. There's always gonna be some kind of uh, like like you're always gonna be associated with somebody from somewhere, somebody or some group. Point blank period. But it's just up to you to navigate through that, bro. Like you don't have to do certain things. Like I like you feel me. You don't you don't, bro. And um, for your dad to have went through that, I'm just hoping that he's smart enough to learn from other people's mistakes, and you know, has to be the one to. So you see your dad put put his hot his hand on that stove, and he's probably told you a million and one times, like, yeah, don't put your hand there, nigga. I'm living proof that if you put your hand there, it's gonna f up your your, your left hand forever, nigga. You ain't gonna have no redos. They're not gonna want to hear the reasoning or nothing. You feel me? So I, I'm hoping he's smart enough to realize, like, nah, nigga, I'm not I'm not gonna put my left hand, right hand, or nothing. On that stove, you know what I'm saying? So I gotta, I just gotta, I gotta be, I gotta, I gotta hope though. I gotta hope that he lived in. Mm-hmm. But once he moved out of there, he wasn't toting guns or gang banging or he like he made his millions. Mm-hmm. This nigga's gonna be a Hall of Fame athlete is because he chose to focus on his way out, and as a result, everybody around him got a chance to win too. His family, his friends, all of that, because now he has hundreds of millions of dollars. When you have an opportunity this big in front of you, especially as an athlete, you get so many new people that start whispering in your ear, hitting you up, and I know it can be tempting, but come on, bro, you just Italian can't carry. You can't carry, dog. And you know his nil shit is in the millions, right? Yeah. Now that now that um, amateur your players can get paid his nil deal is in the millions of fucking dollars you have the money to pay for security or you have the smarts to avoid putting yourself in difficult situations situation, it doesn't yeah. mean that you got to be perfect but this just feels like a mistake yeah mistake but it's it's, it's too egregious though that could have been avoided could have should have i hope this is fake i i don't want to dwell too much on this man i want uh you feel me like they, the spotlight is already on you i just hope that this is you feel me you know what I mean? Like, I don't want to see no young brother in jail, especially no, no nobody with a promising future that has, that's so gifted. I don't want to see nobody throw their gift away, man. So I'm just, I'm just praying on it, man. Hopefully this is, this is not real. This is, you feel me? This is all alleged. And this gets thrown out, man. And this man, this young man can focus on his uh, prominent present future. You feel me? So yeah, where y'all let me know how y'all feeling about this, man. It's crazy. This is right not too long after, after the job situation. Not to try to like, you feel me? But it's crazy not like the eyes are starting to be on like, it's already been there, but I feel like now it's even intensifying with the gun violence and all these other different communities and uh, outlets. Damn, man.